Once upon a time, there was a caravan leader who traveled from country to country, selling goods. His caravan was large, with over 500 bullock carts. On one of his journeys, the caravan had to pass through a dense forest. Before entering, the leader gathered everyone and said, Listen carefully, everyone. This forest is dangerous. There are poisonous trees, fruits, leaves, flowers, and even honeycombs. If you see something you've never eaten before, don't touch it until you ask me first. Everyone agreed to follow his advice. Deep in the forest, near a village, there was a tree called the Whatnot Tree. It looked exactly like a mango tree, its trunk, branches, leaves, flowers, and fruits were all very similar. Even the color, shape, smell, and taste of the fruits were almost identical to mangoes. But unlike mangoes, the whatnot fruit was deadly poison. Some members of the caravan reached the tree before the others. They were hungry, and the whatnot fruits looked like delicious ripe mangoes. Without thinking, some of them began eating the fruits immediately. Others remembered the leader's warning, but assumed this was just a different kind of mango tree, so they ate the fruits anyway. Only a few wise ones held back, deciding it was safer to wait and ask the leader. When the leader arrived, the cautious ones asked, Sir, is it safe to eat these fruits? After inspecting the tree, the leader replied, no, no, this isn't a mango tree, it's a poisonous whatnot tree, don't even touch it. The ones who had eaten the fruit were terrified. The leader quickly told them to make themselves vomit, which they did. He then gave them sweet foods raisins, cane sugar paste, sweet yogurt, and honey to help cleanse their mouths of the poison. Sadly, some of the greediest and most foolish had already eaten too much and couldn't be saved. The poison had taken hold, and they died. In the past, when caravans had come to the whatnot tree, people had eaten its poisonous fruits and died in their sleep. The next morning, the villagers would find their bodies, drag them away, and steal all the goods from the caravan. This time, the villagers were expecting to do the same. At dawn, they rushed to the whatnot tree, eager to claim the bullocks, carts, and merchandise. But when they arrived, they were shocked to find most of the caravan still alive. They asked, how did you know this wasn't a mango tree? The caravan members replied, we didn't know, but our leader warned us, and when he saw the tree, he recognized it. The villagers then asked the leader, wise one, how did you know this wasn't a mango tree? He answered, I knew for two reasons. First, this tree is easy to climb, and second, it's right next to a village. If the fruits on such a tree are left untouched, they can't be safe to eat. Everyone was amazed at how simple common sense had saved their lives. The caravan continued its journey safely. Moral, the wise are guided by common sense, while fools are driven by hunger.